Before a crowd of over 34,000, Cork United come out to meet Dundalk at Delimount Park for the Football Association of Ireland Cup. The ground is hard and there's a testing breeze. And it brings a thrill of excitement. In the whole of Dundalk's history, it has been cupless. And there's a feeling that today, something is going to happen. And it does. In the first half, Dundalk play with the wind behind them. Lunn is an unexpected absentee from the team. Grice is at left half, and McArdle at inside right. The first half is without a score, and Cork United's prospects look rosy in the second half, when in the seventh minute they take the lead. That goal is just the sort of medicine Dundalk seem to need. Five minutes after Cork's first goal, Dundalk get on equal terms. O'Neill starts the movement by running down to take a throw in by Donnelly. Barlow rushes in and heads the ball back to Kelly, who shoots from point-blank range. After 25 minutes, Dundalk takes the lead. Kelly from Lavery's pass slips the centre half and fires in a hard shot from the edge of the penalty area. The ball passes over Foley's right arm and into the net. For a time, Cork besieged Dundalk's goal and forced three corners in succession but Dundalk hold on to their lead. Nine minutes before the end, Lavery scores a grand third. Dundalk win the cup for the first time with a score of 3-1.